Hello and welcome to Learning Science. In this video, we will explore what is new in mobile formatting option for February 2022 Power BI update. This option is now in preview. Now you can separate the formatting for the visuals and reports between Power BI mobile and desktop with different formatting options for each one. This is a major improvement in mobile layout designing. Now you will no longer depend on some workaround like making hidden copy of visual in your web layout so that you can use them in mobile. Please also watch our videos how to design Power BI report for mobile devices, how to access Power BI report on mobile phone and tablets. Link of both video in description box. Let us jump to the computer and show you the demo for this new mobile layout options. So this is my sales report page, so I'll convert it into a mobile layout. First thing you have to enable the mobile layout options. So here option and setting option. In preview feature, you will able to see here the modify visual settings for mobile layout. So if it is not enable, so please enable it first and say OK, close the Power BI desktop and restart the Power BI desktop again. So let me jump to mobile layout. So this is my page title. So first I will select this one and I will change the color of this title. So here I will go to effects. The background color I will change some different color. No different color. Let me bring the line chart. So here if you can see the X axis levels, Y axis level and the data level all are font size are very big. So let me make it smaller. So here in X axis. I will reduce the size. In Y axis. In value. I'll reduce a size 8. Once you reduce the or if you make any changes, you will see there will be the small icon will appear here. And whatever the changes you are making in the mobile layout, it will not impact on your web layout. So these are the two changes and one more thing I will do. I will reduce the size of data level. So currently it is 10. I'll make it 8. So now it looks. Great, so let me bring the my donut chart. If you notice here, I'm unable to see all my three regions. So I'll make changes. So what I'm going to do, I'll go to legend and select top center. So now I'm able to see all my three regions. OK, similarly, if you want to make uh, some changes in uh, bar chart sales by country you can do it otherwise if you are comfortable with the any visual and you don't want to make any changes don't do anything so one more important tip thing which i want to show you for let me go back to the web layout now what i'm going to do i will change the background color to this color and if i will go back to the mobile layout my color is still same so if you want a some colors or some setting should be inherited from the web layout. So you have to don't change the color here like like I, if I want to. Inherited the background color from the my. Uh, my desktop or the web layout, so what I'm going to do here, I'll select this and. In the effects, I will click here clear mobile changes. Once I will click on the clear mobile changes, now the background color of mobile layout and the background color of web layout is same. Now again, if I will change here. Some different color like. This color, so again I will go back. You will see this color. So this will be up this. This will be applicable for all visual and all the settings. 
So I hope this will be useful. And that's all for this video. I request you to please subscribe my channel and thank you for watching.